In today's video, the problem is from functions of a complex variable. So now we have to prove that dou square by dou x square plus dou square by dou y square is equal to 4 times of dou square by dou z into dou z bar. And again, we have to prove that dou square by dou x square plus dou square by dou y square into modulus of f of z whole square is equal to 4 times of modulus of f dash of z whole square. And see here, first of all, as you all know, so from the solution, we have z is equal to x plus i y. And it's very clear that z bar is equal to x minus i y. So if I add these two, these three equations, then z plus z bar is equal to, so I can cancel this one and I'll be getting 2x. So our x value, see here our x value is equal to z plus z bar by 2. And again, if I subtract these two equations, that is z minus z bar. So here, z minus z bar is nothing but. So if I subtract, then minus get cancelled and this will be 2yi. So this is 2yi and our y value is equal to z minus z bar by 2i. So if I multiply with i, then our y value will be i times of that is z minus z bar into here this is 2 i square this is 2 i square i square is nothing but minus 1 that is i times of z minus z bar by minus 2 so we have our x value see here we have our x value as z plus z bar by 2 and y value as minus i by 2 times of z minus z bar so we have two values x and y now we have dou by dou z is equal to according to the formula that is dou by dou x of dou x by dou z plus this is dou by dou y of this is dou y by dou z now see it's so simple that dou by dou x value so here i need dou by dou x so i am starting with dou by dou x so here dou by dou x value is dou by dou x of x with respect to z so here z is 1 and what remains here so here this will be half so the value here is half and the next value here is dou by dou y of so this value is nothing but dou by dou by of y with respect to z so y with respect to z z is 1 here and this will be minus i by 2 so the value here is this is minus i by 2 so now our dou z by dou y value will be see here dou by dou z value is equal to half if i bring this will be dou by dou x minus i times of this is dou by dou y so here dou by dou z bar value will be half times of dou by dou x in place of minus m rating plus dou by dou y. So these are the two equations dou by dou z and dou by dou z bar. So if I multiply these two equations, so consider these two as equation 1 and equation 2 and see here. So if I multiply these two equations, then see what happens here. Then dou by dou z into dou by dou z bar value is equal to this is half times of this is dou by dou x minus i into dou by dou y and again this is half times of dou by dou x plus i times of this is dou by dou y and see if i multiply so this equation will become so this equation will become this is dou square by this is dou z into dou z bar is equal to this is half into half which is equal to 1 by 4 times of c this is dou by dou x i times of dou by dou y into here this is dou by dou x plus i times of this is dou by dou y and see a plus b into a minus b see here it's very clear a plus b into a minus b is nothing but a square minus b square just i'm going to write the same thing that is 1 by 4 times of what is a square a square is nothing but dou square by dou x square so i square is nothing but minus and here 
a square minus b square so this will be dou square by dou y square so here therefore i got dou square by dou x square plus dou square by dou y square value as if i send this 4 to other side this will be 4 times of dou square by this is dou z into this is dou z bar so half of the problem is completed see here in this question in the first question we have to show that dou square by dou x square plus dou square by dou y square is equal to 4 times of dou square by dou z into dou bar so this is completed so the second part is we have to multiply both sides with modulus of f of z whole square now i am going to multiply so the first proof is completed in the second proof see what i am going to do proof number two so this is or else a solution two so according to the solution two we have this equation and in this equation now what i am going to do is i am multiplying both sides with c we have already we have dou square by dou x square plus dou square by dou y square and, and now i am going to multiply with modulus of f of z whole square on both sides this is four times of so this is four times of dou square by dou z dou z bar so this is dou z bar into here also this is modulus of f of z whole square and see the thing, the next step I am going to do here is, so this is 4 times of dou square by, this is dou z into dou z bar, dou z bar, so modulus of f of z whole square, since we have a formula that, see here, mod z whole square is nothing but z into z bar, so this can be written as, so if, it, if I consider this as z, so comparing with this, so I can write this as f of z into f of z bar. So this is nothing but, this can be written as f of z into f of z bar. And see here, so this is 4 times of, this is dou by dou z bar. And now if I derive with respect to z, that is f of z into f of z bar and see what happens here so this will be 4 times of this is 4 times of dou by dou z bar if i make a derivative then this will be f dash of z into this is f of z bar and now if i consider the equation here so if i make a derivative with respect to bar so this is bar and this is bar so this will be 4 times of f dash of z and now if i make a derivative for this this will be f dash of z bar and now see here so according to this z z bar is nothing but modulus of z whole square so if it is z z bar so this can be written as 4 times of modulus of f of z whole square so according to this according to this so what is in the left hand side so the left hand side is nothing but dou square by dou x square plus dou square by dou y square into modulus of f of z whole square so therefore we got the answer as or the result as therefore dou square by dou x square plus dou square by dou y square into modulus of f of z whole square is equal to 4 times of modulus of f dash of z whole square see here it's very clear so these are the two proofs which we have to do first as you know that z is equal to x plus i by and z bar is equal to x minus i by if you add for one time we'll be getting the x value if we subtract we'll be getting the y value so for y value if i multiply and divide with i so i'll be getting y as i so i times of z minus z bar by minus 2. So this is our x value and this is our y value. So we need dou by dou z. So dou by dou z according to the partial derivative this is dou by dou x of dou x by dou z plus dou by dou y of dou y by dou z. So here what is dou x by dou z? So this is x with respect to z this will be half and with respect to y this will be minus i by 2. So if I take half common this is this and similarly dou by dou z bar will be plus. So if I multiply 
if I multiply both sides and I will be getting a plus b into a minus b is nothing but a square minus b square and this is proof number 1 or solution number 1 and the, according to the second solution I have to multiply the same equation with the modulus of f of z whole square so here z z bar is nothing but mod z whole square so this will be modulus of so mod z whole square can be written as z z bar so if i make derivative with respect to z so this will be dash if i make with respect to z bar so this will be modulus of f dash f dash of uh, z bar so this can be written as according to this this can be written as modulus of f dash of z whole square and this is what it was asked to show that and thank you so much for watching if you really like this video please practice if you don't understand this video go through this video for one more time then definitely you can catch up my point and have a look at my next video too thank you so much